Hi guys, PD here. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another new video. Last night I played the brand new Borderlands game, Tiny Tina's Wonderlands, Ivial Vorpex. It works really, really well. There's no talking in this video, but I did record my gameplay. And as you can see from the video, I'm playing the game standing up with the motion controllers. I made a profile for the game Vorpex, and the experience is very similar to how you play Borderlands VR. The only difference is you don't have controls over your weapons, you can't hold things in your hands. Basically, the motion controllers are emulating a gamepad. So I'm playing with the motion controllers, but I'm playing the game the same way I play the game with a gamepad on a flat screen. If you've played the latest Cyberpunk mods from Vorpex and Luke Ross, then you know how this plays. This plays exactly the same way. Full VR mode, Geometry 3D, I'm inside the world, there's no windows anywhere, I'm not looking into any boxes, I'm actually inside the game like a normal VR game and the world is around me. This game is exclusive to the Epic Store, so the game is only available on the Epic Store so far. To get this to work, you will need a copy of Vorpex. You need to run the game at least once to get the files and folders for Vorpex. Then you need to go to Vorpex and you need to find my profile for the game. Go to Cloud Profiles and search for Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Import the profile and apply the settings. I'm running the game on medium settings. I also set the FOV to the maximum. My profile supports direct VR scan. So the first time you run the game with Vorpex running, bypass all the main menu, bypass all the intros, get into the actual game. Then you need to bring up the Vorpex menu by hitting the delete key. And if you scroll down, you should be able to see Direct VR Scan. If you hit this button, it's going to scan the game and it's going to give you the best possible FOV, head tracking and 3D. There's no commentary in this video, it's late at night, all my family is in bed. Enjoy the gameplay, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!
Alas, the weight of the world was too much for this breach. You recognize one of the Queen's Waystones. It seems to call to you. The Queen's magic enters you through the stone, granting you the power of... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Aura! You now have magical sight and hair in the... Queen Butt Stallion! She's guiding us on our quest! Sure enough, baby. A trail of spectral hoof prints leads off into the woods. your path. What you gonna do about it, huh? I cast Identify Tree. It's a species called Jumpus Tutorialis, and weirdly, it only grows in this one valley. you forward. Some hot lumberjane has left her axe in a stump. This steel feels like it was meant for me. I love a good axe. Great for cleaving, hacking, even a good old-fashioned chop-chop. A cave mouse sits covered over nearby. If only you could get in. The magical hoof prints continue to the cave. The rocky ceiling dips low to the ground. A true fate maker knows when to stand tall and when to crouch. Now's the time, the time I was talking about. It's crouching time! Yeah, work them sweet glutes. And if you get a running start and crouch, You'll slide around like a cool action hero. Reaching it will mean going through a pack of nasty, pinchy crabs. Yeah! Combat! Kill them all! Ah, pinchy! They're so pinchy! I hope you made your peace. They were carrying their life savings for some reason. All yours now. I think we killed everything down here. Climb up there and follow the hoof prints.
them brighter days. That's right. The queen has ruled the Wonderland since I was but a humble player, like you, Bing Bong. Yeah. She has foreseen your arrival and left a powerful weapon for you. The weapon of a fate maker. It's a gun! Hardly a fine weapon. But in the hands of a champion, anything can bring glory. Wait, there's guns in fantasy? You're in Tainus fantasy, baby! Shrine floor rises beneath you. From here, you can spy a quaint little village nestled in the bodacious bosom of the valley. <laughs> but beyond it, a dark and ancient castle lurks. Lurkingly. Doubtless the Dragon Lord has made his foul nest within that dark ruin. It's like a magical shield above your health. Pretty sweet. Lost hope. Ahead, you hear the roar of raging fire and the clackety clackety of bones. We're here to save the village. Ooh. 
Ooh, the village is already ransacked and crawling with skilly men. We're here to avenge the village! Never win, hero! A felling blow! Carfax, you're a powerful wizard who has seen the twenty sides of the world. You floated like a leaf upon the Wibblesome winds. You spoke the vanishing words at Holcren's Pass. Just because you've retired to this anonymous village doesn't mean you've lost your magic. If you can just master this iceberg, maybe the rest will come back too. Save her peasant ass. Thank you for saving my peasant ass stranger. How can I ever repay you? <laughs> a hero's work is its own reward. I am on a quest to defeat the Dragon Lord. You're a fate maker. I knew the queen would send us a hero. The tomb is in the crypt below Castle Herofast. You must hurry before his minions find it. The tomb is inside a crypt. The perfect hiding place. May the Queen's favor see your noble quest through. Oh, my peasant ass is killing me! The ruins of Castle Harrowfast are just out yonder. Which is fantasy for saying. It's over there, baby! I sense the Dragon Lord's presence! His tomb is somewhere beneath these ruins! Find 
him, fellow skeletons! A villain in our midst! upon yonder parchment. Verily, tis a poem! Surely the author would be glad to see its safe return. When you got more than one gun, you can switch between them. Keeps combat spicy, like jambalaya! So, Tina, maybe after this quest, I could be the Bunker Master. I've been working on a campaign. It's got orcs and kissing. Tina don't play no more, okay? But it's all good. I got mega tons of questicles simmering up in my brain sauce, baby. Hold fast! Strike through! Thank you. 
shall never be. The last of the hero bloodline sits in her ancient throne, her bones clutching a dusty spellbook as though awaiting a destiny that never came. Well, this place is super grim. I love it. Grab that spellbook. I must wield this magic with honor. With the spellbook equipped, you can cast the frost spell contained within. I bet it's extra strong against the undead. They got none of that. Now, how do we get into the tomb crypt? There's got to be an entrance around here somewhere. The floorboards of the throne hall seem uh, rotten and brittle. of what we want! We gotta get in there! Figurine for this guy. One second. Rising before you is one of the Dragon Lord's most loyal undead soldiers. It's Rivula. Roll for initiative. Tremble before Rivula. Oh! 
My conscience is clear.